Hello everyone, it's Erica. Welcome back to my channel. I'm aware there are eye bags under my eyes and on top of that my room is a bit of a mess, but ignoring that, I just wanted to make a little intro to my video, which is going to be my reaction to my A-level results. It's the 17th of August today. It's 9 p.m. roughly, so that means I'll be getting my results in probably 11 hours if I've done the math right. I don't know, I think I failed math, but roughly 11, 12 hours, I'll be getting my results because they come out tomorrow, 18th of August at 8 a.m. So I just wanted to make a little intro for the video to sort of explain how things went this year because I didn't film exam vlogs for the actual exams themselves. Also, if you hear things, that's my family, they're downstairs. But yeah, I feel like this exam season was a bit of a weird one because obviously it was the first in-person set of exams I've sat since ever because both GCSE years I didn't sit any proper exams but I'm going to be honest I feel very very nervous I don't want to rant too much about it because there's no point in sort of worrying about it because it's not it hasn't happened yet and I don't know things are very uncertain so there's no point in sort of worrying myself sick but yeah I am nervous um, I think maths will definitely be the one like I won't be that surprised if I don't get what I want but yeah, um, the subjects I do, by the way, are maths, biology, and Spanish. I do three A-levels, and I'm in my AS year, so it's just the first year of the two-year course. And I'll be getting mine online, so I'll, you'll see me tomorrow morning. And that's basically all. Okay, it is the morning of. I'm pretty sure they've already come out. It's 8 a.m. And I just feel like I need to go and vomit everything I've eaten in the last 24 hours. I have my code. I wrote it down because I lost the actual thing, which is very typical of me. My hands are shaking. It's already 8.01. Eh? Center number and candidate number. I'm gonna, I need to go get that. Hold on. So, I got it. I am shaking. I'm having literal heart palpitations. First of all, do not mind the state of me. I just woke up. I only got out of bed about 15 minutes ago. My voice is like that too because I haven't spoken a word this morning. That's kind of concerning. Hold on. <laughs> I didn't look at these uniform marks. Hold on. I'm going to read out my results. Um, I do biology, maths, and Spanish for my A-levels. I've mentioned this already, but just in case you didn't know, and I got three A's, which is the highest grade you can get at AS level for where I am. So I'm very, very happy with that. The thing I was talking about the unexpected thing earlier is because Spanish is my best subject or at least I thought it was until it became the subject I got the lowest mark in I because I was really expecting it to be maths I don't know how I got the mark that I got because we had one exam for maths and I left out the last like two huge eight mark questions like as in left out I really did not touch them I looked at them and then the exam was over and I left and then it, they were just blank. Oh, you can see the modules. Oh no. What? Wait a minute. You can see the, you, hold on. You can see all the marks. I'm just gonna read out the results I got so it gives sort of a better picture. Okay, basically biology AS unit one um, both units are out of 75 and I got 66 in the first one, 65 in the second one. And then maths really shocked me. I told you I left out 16 marks worth of questions. It was out of 100 and I got 80 marks. Uh, this is all raw marks. Um, and then for Spanish, unit 1 was out of 75 and I got 69. And then unit 2 was out of 100, I got 89. And unit 3 was out of 75, and I got 72. Um, and then the uniform marks made, the, made it like higher 
I guess, but I guess that's how standardization works depending on the difficulty of the test. For biology, both units, the maximum uniform mark was 90, and I got 89 in both. And then for maths, maximum uniform mark was 96, and I got 93. And for Spanish, unit 1, it was 60, I got 56 out of 60. Unit 2, I got 74 out of 80. And unit 3, I got 58 out of 60. So that is a breakdown of all the exams I had. I didn't expect there to be such detail in the results because last year it was just grade, 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 you know what I mean? But yeah, that's basically my reaction. I'm happy with that. I actually have study vlogs from exam season, like before everything started that I haven't posted yet. So I might post those in the run up to when school starts. But anyways, again, apologies about my voice. I'm aware it sounds very hoarse and doesn't sound like me but thank you so much for watching this video if you like my content subscribe to my channel and i'll see you in the next video bye